So, yeah. Hello and good morning, good day, good night, whatever time it is at your <laughs> particular location. My name is Sebastian and you are watching The Nervous Prospect. Welcome back to Space Engineers. Now, I have been a little busy during the weekend, just sort of um, completely offline, just while I was yeah feeling bored. I have I've built more on the base. We, we've gone and finished the base as it were. Well, not finished, but you know, I've, I've shaped a lot more. I've pulled a, put a roof on. We have, I've, you can see the, the gate is a lot bigger. Um, I can now literally take the rover out in one spin. Um, I have took out the gates that were here. That's gone. Um, I've put up a, and I've not really showed this off correctly. And of course I'm gonna get stuck. And yeah, build and repair does things, that's all fine. But yeah, we've I've put nice stairs here in. Right, and we've got a gantry that I can sort of go along here and yeah, uh, look out at our monument to Clang. You know, um, I, I, I like the idea of having some windows here. Um, so I feel it's really coming nicely together, this bit. Um, and then, yeah, I wanted this gantry so I could maybe access things from the top when I build in here or have a bigger rover in here, you know, things like that. Um, so, what else? I have also gone and done a bit of voxel shaping. I've put blocks down here. Um, I've made a, a nice corridor here that I've also gone and removed some of the grass. And we've basically got access to pretty much any height of the anchor bay, as it were, you know, those two access points. Um, made another window or viewport, if you will, from here, just so you can quickly look out and have a look at the miner before you can go and say, hey, let's go and have a look at it all. Awesome. Um, what else did I do? I'm just trying to see. So I have, I've built... Uh, oh, um, I have, so I've worked on this blueprint, and we're going to get to that in a minute. Um, but yeah, just a bit of shaping, really, and I'm, I'm not entirely happy with this corner, but eh. You know, it's, it's not completely done, but I, I like it, you know, and then I've gone and put some some platform around here, just around the monument. I, I just felt that was a thing I wanted to do. Um, and yeah, so that's basically <clears throat> that part. Now, for here, <clears throat> there's going to be a few changes. I have a blueprint change, so we need to go in. Thank you, Tarsus. Looking good, very much so. Yes, uh, it <clears throat> took me actually not all that long. It was more the, again, my mine, mining for iron, <laughs> the usual. Um, so I'm looking now for the projector for the decoy north. I'm going to remove that blueprint for now. Um, there's the novice decoy. And so I've, I've made a little uh, world with literally just space and a few asteroids in it. And that's what I'm using to go and create my blueprints in. That's why it's looking completely different from what we're normally seeing, right? Um, and so there's a few changes here in this blueprint. First of all, um, now this control seat can go away afterwards. But first of all, I have a... Yeah, we're going to have to do a bit of grinding here. Um, let me see. I think I can go in here. Oh, I forgot the music. Um, two seconds, guys. I have music queued up. Oh, a bit. Yeah, like so. Um, and I try to mix up this time a bit more faster music, if you will. The drum and bass and that. Nope. That was not the thing that I needed. There's a block I need out here. That is actually a projector now. Um, no, that's fine. Just take that off. There's nothing attached at the moment. So what I've done, I'm trying to show this off. And I need to grind it away anyways. Right, um, there is a projector in this decoy. In this blueprint. Let's 
this guy, I think. Yeah, there's our projector, right? And so the way I've set this up, the projector itself contains all this, right? It's literally got its own blueprint. <clears throat> and so my idea was, uh, if I if I go and build this projector up, right? I'm hoping. Okay, so what was it? Large steel tube, you see? Can we pull them through, I wonder? No, we cannot. Okay, there's something in my connection here that's not working. Right, and I will have to check that um, over at some point. Like, soon. Let's have a look. Um, just give me the components, okay? But it's obvious that there's somewhere here is a connection issue. Because this should literally just lead right through into these. Okay, but not to worry right now. I'm... Where is the projector? And if I'm not mistaken... Should be able to sit down on this. Turn this projection off. And okay, maybe not. That is curious. Okay. Um. Now, if I remember right, this projector oh hasn't got a blueprint in it. Okay. So note to self. Uh, today I learned when you place a projector with a blueprint in it. Like, it doesn't get copied into the blueprint. You have to actually go and load it in. Now, if I'm not entirely mistaken, all I need to do is just change the... There's one offset that just needs changed. Where is... and I think I think it's just like so mm, nope nope okay uh, stop 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 oh crud this doesn't look right at all okay um I'm gonna try and work on this seat then. Um, just going. Nope. There's a normal projector. That's got no name in it. Um, so increase, decrease forward offset, increase forward offset, then decrease vertical offset, and increase the vertical offset, and then horizontal offset. Right. And if I'm not mistaken, um, okay. So you can see the change there that I've got in the blueprint. There's actually more turrets now, right? Um, and this has been extended at the bottom a bit because there's a new assembler. But yeah, this this looks like I wanted it. This is the way I wanted it to be. Okay, cool. Um, I will have to do a little bit of grinding. Taking all this away. Even care, just oh, okay. no, that's fine. yeah, yeah. No, built and repair is gonna pick this up when we are turning it back on. Um, like, I suppose I could do just this for now, right? We could just deposit things 
And I need to just get rid of this basic assembler. Because if you remember, it's the basic assembler that's actually holding our production back a bit. So, you know, I've decided to go and um, do it this way. Well, I know I could paint it red, Tarsus, because of my built and repair, but for now I've actually decided to just do it manually because I want to be fairly careful on where I'm grinding, if that makes sense. Um, but I feel like this is definitely where we would want to be. There's a block here that we could place just to put it closer to the ground. Um, but yeah, 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 yeah. I, I like this. I think we're good to go now until Built and Repair built this up for us. I feel that is now a thing that I can do. And there's. Projector is now built. There's a. Was this a heavy armor block there? That's good to protect it. Um, this is a light armor block. Heavy armor corner. Mm -hmm. Could probably do with making this heavy, but it's fine. Um, so for now, it is down. And. Mm. So. So actually, Tarsus, um, I have set this up to be an ultra low latency stream. I'm, I'm trying to figure out if this actually helps our delay issues a little bit. Um, so I, I don't know, probably give you a timestamp, but right now it is 9.45 our time. And just if you give me a little thing when you get it. Because I would like this to be fairly interactive, and I, because we've done really quite well with that. Um, but yeah, we're, we're quite good here. Um, we're going to be short on resources. Ow. Um, and I think our big one this time is going to be Cobalt, actually. If I'm not entirely mistaken. What was uh, production... So we're at a minute. We're at a minute. That is that is a lot better than the three minutes we had before. There's about a minute delay now between what you're seeing and then the res response coming back to me. Um, that makes me happy. Good, 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 good. Um, so yeah, I was talking about, and I would like to sort of confirm this for myself. These heavy armor blocks, right? They are yeah metal grids, and they take fifty metal grids. Okay. And if I now go and check it and how these are made, yeah, it's cobalt. So let's see if I can repeat the feat from last night and get the miner out and do some mining without actually trashing things. So I like to sort of do this. Um, Yeah, so it's it's for me it's a little bit of a toss up, uh, Tarsus, because I do actually like the ability to have uh, closed captions, um, but you can only go low latency for that, and that's where we have that three minute delay. And you know, it's again, it's a toss up that I'm gonna have to sort of make, and I'm quite happy to actually say, you know what, in this case, we're gonna be fairly live. Uh, all the thrusters are on, and off we go. And I'm sure Cobalt is no, it's not. Um, okay, it's that way. Which is fine too. Um, now, I have no idea if we have placed or detected sign of sign on here. Like, I feel we should have. Should have. Uh, but it doesn't look like it. Okay, I, I of course I didn't. Do we have an actual cobalt mine? Did I do such a thing? Silicon ice. Okay, um, I'm gonna have to turn back. 
We're gonna have to get um With iron and gold, okay, yeah, but it's uh, okay. Cool. At this point we're gonna have to get um some auto tech on here, that that would be definitely the thing to do. I'm just going to be quite lazy and just bring the grid close. Right, just... Um, we have our... And then we can lock in. I'm happy with that. Bam. Uh, or detector and antenna. You're gonna have to fit that here. Yeah. That's just what it is. Because I am an idiot! Well, maybe not an idiot, but, you know, silly. I'm forgetting important things. Um, no, that, that was on the robot I'd done that, so this is fine. Um, yeah, place an antenna there, please, and an ore detector. Just there, right? Yeah, as I say, maybe not an idiot, just a silly. <laughs> um, and that is pretty much now done. Perfect. <clears throat> this is going to help us a big deal, so let me just quickly set up the bars for that. Um, antenna, toggle block on, off, and then do the same for the ore detector toggle block on off and then just set up ranges and um, there's the ore detector just ramp that all the way up make sure it's using the antenna <laughs> yeah human uh, that's a nice way of putting it um thank you tarsus yeah I can, I can rely on my um stream viewers to you know build me up i, I love that yeah in this community um so yeah broadcast radio about 1k seems fine and then we can unlock, take off, pull the legs, and whoa, uh, dampness. <laughs> All about them. And then we're just gonna go and push the wrong buttons, apparently. Yeah, there we go. Um, and cobalt. Yeah. No, what do you mean combat face? No, 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 no. Okay, dear base, fend for yourself. Uh, that's all I'm gonna say. So, but yeah, that's a little mining run. And then I can just do the pass, let go. We're not using any energy. It's nice. I like that. So, okay, now coming down, and there's the cobalt. Nice. I'm gonna do just because I feel that way inclined. Oh, right, okay, I forgot it's a surface thing. Okay. Uh, it'll be a bit of cobalt. And then just try and sort of. Oh! No, 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 no. I've done a Sebastian again. Just about crashed my ship there. That's because I still haven't fixed that thrust vector. And all of this will be stone. Like most of this. Do we have ejectors active on this? One. Why you no work? Okay, um... Oh, you can't even do that. And just give me stone, and I'll do this.
Yeah, I, I know. Ejector. We've got two ejectors actually on the on on on, on the thing. Okay. Three. Yeah, ejector two. What 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 what's your deal? Wait, do we have a sorter before that? I'm sure I did. I think that's what I've done. I've not set up the sorter right. Right. Yeah. yeah see, blacklist. No. What we need is a whitelist, and it's. Stone, 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 add that to the whitelist. Right, boom. Uh, drain all. Drain all, nice. And then we can go and look at that other ejector. Um, just because I don't like that. And is it collect all? Uh, and throw out. I think that's what I'm needing to do here. Throw out and collect all. Right, okay, that's that's better. That's better. Okay, cool. I, I should have really set um, set one up on the right one uh, the right side too, but meh, them's the brakes. But I really really need to fix that thrust vector. You know the sideways thrust, basically. And I think that was all the cobalt we had, like, in this particular spot. Which is fine. I shouldn't think so. Um, and besides, it's dark, I'm not looking now. <laughs> Um, I may look again during the day, but eh, if there's a voxel or death, uh, it will be there. <laughs> hey, let's just drop stone all over the base. <laughs> uh, it's like a trail of stone poop. <laughs> As I say, Tarsus, when I'm when it's daytime, I'll probably go past it with a miner and just do a right-click emptying thing. Ooh, what, 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 what did I find there? Magnesium and nickel. Ooh. I will mark those up, please. Oh, actually, there... I could probably get away with just using... Uh, doing something with a large grid ore detector on my base, but no, no. Oh, silicon too. This is, this is a nice little, it's fairly close too. I, I like it. Um, so GPS, earth, and then we're doing this thing because we haven't actually dug the mines yet. So S I M G and M G and what was the last one? Nickel. So just to mark the location, just so I know, right? Because I know me, I will forget. So I definitely need a bit more sideways thrust, like... I know, I know, it's got to be high up and... Um, it's it's ugly. I I ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, I keep forgetting there's a lot of weight on me. Ooh, nice. And locked in. And then we can do the turn that off, turn that off, turn that off. And put the batteries up back on charge and <laughs> it's raining stone hallelujah it's raining stone <laughs> and dear youtube that was not a copyright strike don't you bloody dare i'm just going to say it right now 
Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm just going to say it, right? Just because I have spent a bit of time. I, I really like, by the way, the way this has, has come together and I sort of have these different access points and maintenance halls, if you will. So I, I like that. It's, it's, yeah. Makes me happy. Very happy. Shoo, and what next? Um, we could probably, yeah, let, let's let's do that thing because uh, we had it last time, and I, I feel we want to do it again. Um, let me find the yes number eight. <clears throat> I I really did like that. Now I know these are have a they have a facing. Um, I think we're gonna do it right. Oh, <clears throat> interior plane, of course. Thank you. Um, would like it to be, yeah, that, that sort of seems to be the middle. And yeah, just like so. Bam, bam, put that together. And then now remember, um, because this is not something that's shown a lot, and Paris is actually helped taught me about this so I'm gonna show you this again and um, when you go to the actual you know character to its uh, control panel there is a thing where you can say show me the census field range all right okay so the sensor facing I was just reliably informed when you look at it, it looks like a smiley face Yeah, and no, I can I can sort of see that. Like, but I'm assuming that to be the eye. No, I, I don't know. Um, but we should. Okay, now let's set the sensor up. No, there is K to open the control panel, right? Um. So, detect small ships, large ships. Well, players, yes, but I think owner, yes, friendly, yes, neutral, nope, nope. That's for sure. Not asteroids. I'm not sure about the subgrids thing, if we need it or not. I don't think we do. Because what we do, what we have is a small ship in this case, it's a small grid rover. Um, no floating objects. And player at the moment, fine, okay. And then the, the setup action is when you detect. <clears throat> and this is very important to know now because I've, I got this wrong last time. Because I just assumed you have one action open close, you know. But no, it is an action for activation and there's an action for like loss of detection, if you will. Um, so what we're going to say is on detection, we want to open it and on loss of detection, we'll close it. Right. That seems fine for this part. Now I just need to figure out the extents because I can't see any. Oh, it's done something so the, the detection is definitely working um, um okay this is not gonna be I don't think can we see I don't see any changes so this is having me a little bit confused sense of field range Right, that's, that's what I'm going to need. Just show me that sense of field range. I should... It doesn't help again, I'm half colorblind. So in the menu of the sensor task says, uh, I can say, show me the HUD. No, show... Sen sensor show on HUD. Ah! 
Okay, yeah, I like that. That's actually... Okay, we can work with that because now I can go and pull this menu. Right, and we can say... Um, I think I would like the top extent. Okay, so that's actually not... Oh yeah, okay, that is the top of that particular block, block so that makes sense. So 5 meters seems fine. Um, the back extent we can dial down because that's into the ground right then the bottom extent that's basically the way we yeah I'm facing here we can leave that at that five meter as well quite like that and then we're just gonna change the left and right extents All right I'd like it to be yeah sort of right at the gate width if that makes sense so I'll we'll set it to that 11 meters um, some reason it was 11. Oh yeah, because we're in the middle, I think. So that makes sense. Um, <clears throat> boom, boom, boom. There's one extent I feel... Is it the front extent? No. Ah, forget the six. No, 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 no. We weren't quite done yet. Wait, no. So, uh, this is the front extent I'm wanting. Yes, I want it up. And I want it sort of at gate height. So that's the 10 meters. Um, and from what I can understand and like visualize in, in my head, this line should extend. Oh, it's not extending far enough out. Not by a long shot. So that'll be the top extent in this case. Um, so I'm, I'm curious. I think five is fine there, but I need to extend it to the top because we're sort of needing to traverse the, 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 the gate as well. So say seven meters maybe. And then do your thing. Mm. Yes. I think we'll go for the 11 meters. That seems like a good entry space. Yeah. Oh, oh and there we go. <laughs> Had to happen. Uh, let me just go and find my clone counter. <clears throat> well, Dems the brakes, and well, no point looking because built and repair. I'm sure, like, yeah, there's there's one tool, there's a bottle, there's a drill, um, yeah, obviously that's uh, true with the, with the sensor, depending on how you place it, you know, those change. But because it was face down, what I was looking at is actually the top extent and the bottom extent, whereas the back extent would be the one into the ground. The front uh, extent is the one going up and then left, right. So, um, let me just find my other tools. Now, I have to imagine and assume Unless built and repair what was off. No, it wasn't. Oh my goodness. A grinder, drill. Welder. That's what I was missing. And then just give me another bottle. Not two. Yep. Oh, also. My gun. A rifle. I don't know. Is it called a rifle? I, I don't know. Okay. Hide empties and just. Somewhere here. Yeah. You. And give me that ammo, please. Thank you. 
Yeah. Um. But so I, I like this. Um, and if I've um, no, actually, so I'm gonna change this sensor in one regard, right? All the extents are fine. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tell it I don't want you to detect players as such. Okay, small grids. I think that that'd be an awesome thing, right? So, um, show on hard, go turn that off. Turn the sensor field range off for ourselves. And now the question is, can we do this? So, right, we're unlocked. Um, just and then if I turn here. I didn't quite do that right, but yeah, yeah, that, that works. And look at that. Um, and then we can go, and it doesn't help that I've got no light, so I will not be taking a big trip right now. But I should be able to go and approach. Uh, well, actually, let me, let me fix one thing. Uh, dear Rover, please stop. I forgot that. Uh, lights would help, and I would like to just because it makes it easier for me. Where is that block? Okay, need a new yeah that, that guy there. G give me please um and no yeah like so yeah because yeah of course. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Superb. Ish. Uh, this is fine. Um. And that. Right, and then give me some steel plate, please. Um. And balls. So yeah, Tarsus, um, <clears throat> I'm I'm sort of in two minds about this, right? Um. <laughs> um, I so Tarsus is basically suggesting to no to extend those extents a little bit for early detection. I, mm, I sort of feel like I don't want that gate longer open than it absolutely has to be. If if that makes sense, um, but. I may, I may do it from the inside, but, um, from that perspective, and leave it fairly closed from the outside. Um, and yeah, you just do the thing, please, I think. No? Are you going to need me to do the thing because I forgot to turn built-in repairs on? Probably. So, um, give me those components, please. Thank you. And again, no lights on because I've just died again. I forgot that. Um, and there we go. There's a camera. And then I'm hoping I can just do... Nope, not this. Uh, was it view? I think that's all I need. And then oh, handbrakes on. Let me see how are we lined roughly. So just yeah, that's definitely going to have to come out that extent quite a bit. No, your tires is your right. Yeah, it's it's really not. Ideal. Uh, 
And so I know I've, I've placed these really hideous blocks there, but I felt like I wanted something that is going to stop my wheels before I crash the battery into the connection. Yeah, so that, that's why I've decided to sort of stop, put these stoppers in and don't even know what you would call them, just blocks. Um, but yeah, we're going to have to go and extend those. It, it's not quite as smooth as I would like it. Or, you know, as, as seamless, we are, whatever you want to call it. Info field range. Open this guy. No. And see. Show on HUD, right? And then I think what I'm going to do is, you know, go and bring him up. Ah, oh, for goodness sakes, it is. This is sort of distance I can go. That wasn't it. Right, and then just so this is the bottom extent. I'm just going to bring that out to that 11 meters. Uh, do we need, even need that much? Like, I feel like that would be enough. Because the minute one of the wheels hits that field, it's fine. Uh, eh. Did I do it in a control seat? Um, po possibly, yes. I, I can't even remember, to be honest. And now the other one is the top extent, and I'm just going to ramp that up. Say, 50 meters. That seemed... Um, that seemed fine, so let's try that. Yeah, see? And now as we're approaching, the gate opens, and I can sort of do my lineup. Oh, you dirty... No, 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 no. Oh, you... Yeah, we're gonna have a... Um, I'm, I'm just watching it now. I'm just... Hey, Clang. All hail, Clang. Um, there's a thing I need to change. And this is sort of my fault. And uh, it's, I know it's, it's slightly confusing to see what happened. It's, it's my fault. It's a programmable block. Um, it's this guy that says hangar doors. No, just go and set this to false for now. Oh. Okay. And then recompile this whole thing. And I'm sure my, my, my robot's got to be in between there again. <laughs> uh, but it should stay open now. That was... Yeah, as I say, f totally self-inflicted too. Like, I can't even say anything like um uh, welcome back Tarsus so yeah my rover done things because I had a script I have a door closing script and the door closing script also handles hangar doors because I tilted it to and it yeah it turned out to be I'm actually surprised I got away with a, as little damage as I did, to be honest. I was fully expecting the whole grid to explode around me. Um, but it's it's fine. We've survived it. I will have to go and... The rover counter... Because I've done it twice. Um, nope. And then, yeah, go and place... Oh, I thought that was a conveyor. No, it's uh, not. not yeah. I go into that's that's the guy I want. And I can't because let me guess resources. Yeah, yeah, it's something, something. For 
six. Yes, like so. Yeah, that's fine. Um, but okay, so lesson learned there a little bit. Let me go and just. Oh, you're doing the thing. But okay, I'm just gonna do this and this. Right. Um. So yeah. Um. This is actually working fine. I would just like to get this quickly built up again, and I'm just gonna help along. Why does it look like it's not correcting itself? Oh no, that's a, that's a good connection. Okay, okay. Um, let's try that again. Right, awesome. And I can drive through here. And, and like from the outside, I think that extend is fine. Um, you can see it's starting there. And feel that is okay. Like, I don't want it like miles out into the. Well, not miles, but you know, hundreds of meters or even just. 50 meters or so, it just seems a bit much. But this, this feels good. This, this to me feels like it's, you know, nice and secure and yeah, I know I didn't line that up quite correctly, but I can do this thing and now we're locked in. Right. Um, we can even, if we need a bit of maintenance height, I can do this thing. Like it's it's not really necessary because we've got a lot of ground clearance, but it's it's a thing we can do. I just tend not to. I I just don't like the idea of floating grids as up if that makes sense. <laughs> uh product no uh info go and show me not show me that please. And then we can do the whole this guy and say no don't show on hunt because we're now set up i like this um I, I should have probably mentioned um when you're up here on the gantry and you know because i am planning on having this world multiplayer at some point soon fairly soon um you, you know and, and one of your pals is coming in and you're like oh you, you're not in the group yet or in our faction yet and well come in anyways and you can actually stand up here see him coming in and just mm, yeah actuate the gate from there. I, I just felt like that's something I wanted to do. Okay. Um, you know, on top of, obviously, those inside-outside connectors here. Um, oh, not connectors, uh, buttons. Cool. Um, that's all that done. I, like, I, f I feel like I've dicked around long enough with that stuff. It's time to get a few materials. Uh, we'll need some steel plate for sure, um, some interior plate, what else do we need? Uh, I think that's pretty much it to build what I'm needing, I think, I mean, just to at least start it. And so we're going to go and try and get working on this guy a bit. So they're pointing outwards the way, right? I've already set that up correctly ish um needs another hinge there um one of those and no this is for me the question because no not like that same way i think i think i want them both facing thusly i, I just feel like that's the thing I want to do. Um, and if you spare with me, I'm just trying to get something laid out here. And I don't know if it's going to work or not. Um... Uh, 
right okay so it does get built up there um so Tarsus says if i want them to fold in on itself that's exactly what i need to do so perfect perfect um and i have mentioned this a couple of episodes ago i have a sort of idea of what i want to do with those solar panels and i will go and oh good grief where is that should have had this on a timer block yeah correct this all comes out for me then whoa That was slightly clangy. Well, more so than I would have liked, but it's fine. It looks okay. And then, of course, this hinge now fell because we didn't put a hinge lock on it. Um. But so, basically, the lower limit would be zero. If, if, if I've aligned them correctly, that is. And then the upper limit is 90. Um, and then we could check that. Yeah, perfect. And then if we set this to like 0.5 for now. Um, okay, upper lower. And these settings should exactly be the same. Lower. Zero. And then the upper limit 90. That is fine. And then we're going to just do the velocity minus, minus one. As it was there, right? Um, and then basically I should be able to reverse both of those. And they fold in on themselves. Anyways, the idea. Um, let's let's go and do the same here. Um, so again, lower limit. Seems fine. Velocity will set it to minus. Actually, maybe minus five seems a bit more. Yeah, cool. Um, why do I get the feeling you're not aligned the right way? I have this is really nasty lower limit. Oh yeah, this is fine actually. This is fine. Um, there's a lower limit, upper limit, and then we'll set the velocity. Just get it around there quickly to that point. Oh, okay. No, that's correct. Positive velocity brings it around now that max point and then we can say we want to set this as minus 0.5 okay go do the same here just changing the velocities quickly so there is no minus 0.5 and same there um i've done it there already <laughs> see um okay and so then the next step is we're gonna set up a group, I suppose. Uh, no, we're not. Um, and this is now the actual name hinge one. No, uh, chat. So this is the left hand side. Hinge. Um, hinge. left pair one okay oh i didn't do the thing and ah oh no i did do the thing okay uh, that was a little bit weird i didn't do it right it's fine um hinge hinge left yeah, true. I, I don't know, it's not 
exactly what we need it to be, but... And then that's the right pair one and two. I know that that naming convention doesn't really make sense yet, but it, it's fine. Uh, right, pair one. Nope. Hinge, uh, right, pair two. Well, the, the, the point I'm trying to get at with this naming convention is that these are handled as a pair and I can then find them that way and group them together as a, thusly. Uh, so let's sit down. So that, that maybe make, makes more sense if I, if I say it that way and... Left pair one, left pair two, and then right pair one, right pair two. That even looks wrong, that word. A, a pair of pairs, I, I don't know, like... I know pairs is... Uh, I don't know. Ah. Uh, Isis one, we'll call it. No, it's not Isis. Um, ISS. Sorry, I don't even know where that came from. Uh, um, ISS one, sorry. That was terrible. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, you're right, Tarsus. It's something I understand. But I, I felt like I wanted to share my thinking on that as well. Why I named it like that. But now comes the interesting part. Um, because it's dark, we're not going to be able to see. Oh, we'll be able to see good enough, yeah? Well, well enough. Um, <coughs> groups. Uh, so solar hinges, ISS1, this, right, and I'm going to do it on them, it's just say reverse, okay, and, and I would expect that both of those are going around and we should end up with a hinge pointing down. I mean, it looks good so far. And I don't really want this to be ultra fast. Like this, this, these are heavy parts that are moving. You know, you, you want them to move sedately and controlled. But look at that! I, I like that. That is folded in basically. And then if I was to now trigger the timer block, and then I've done this wrong. Fucking damn it! I've done this wrong. Sorry, excuse my language. Yeah, they're gonna have to come back up again. Um, and it's... Um, I think we can just get away with just reversing the, 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 the directionality of those, right? So sit down, grab me a sister. Huh. Uh, sorry guys, I need to hydrate. So, what, what I was saying, thinking, sorry, um, all I really need to do here is we'll set the lower limit, so upper limit 0, lower minus 90, okay, and that way we should have the fold going inside, as it were, But then when you go and trigger the timer block, this is really the whole point. Because, yeah, I need this to all come in nicely. And I'll, I'll love how, how all this came together. I, I absolutely freaking love it. And uh, I think it's... No, it's, it's going through. And yeah, and then the solar panels would be literally folded along the side here on those hinges, on those hinge pairs. 
that is sort of my... I like that idea. I know we were trying to be really dynamic about it, but I think this is... For well, now, with my knowledge and understanding, <laughs> um, this is going to be at least a decent start, and it's still going to allow us to have this grid going together at some point. Now, I don't know if I can do this. I'm, I'm going to just try... So, Tarsus, my thinking is, and yeah, I could easily add it to the timer block we already have. Um, my thinking is I would rather have those to be two independent actions. Like, so, the, 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 the falling of the solar panels itself, because, you know, the truth is, this is not everything that I'm trying to... And that's probably going to clang together if I weld it there. Right, so... Hey, will you just... I don't care about your unknown signal, will you just... Um, yeah, like so, but I think I need a block. Oh, that was a pun and a half, but I'm... Uh, why do I have two timer blocks? I don't even have anything on this, I think. Oh no, I do. Yeah, okay, so that, that's, that's, that's just going to have to... Um, how do you empty thing like this? Like, how do you tell it to just... What, just right-click stuff? Just remove it? Yeah, okay. That, that's apparently all you need to do. Cool. Um, and I certainly, I could probably say, hey, um, yeah, time block, how many actions have we got? Well, I've still got a few. I feel like that's going to be... You know, especially when you're trying to unfold it and... Um, no. Not going to do it. Tempting, but no. Um, I think I would just want this for now. Oh, actually, just bring it on. No, actually, leave it in for now because then I can better understand yeah bring it up and then that'd be a block but I need it yeah okay 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 I understand but now I can go and attach that block there and attach that one there Are we not sharing inertia somewhere? Mm, I'm just wanting to observe for a second here what happens when it's done. Yeah, I feel like we've not shared the inertia tensor somewhere. That could actually well be it. Uh, let me... Oh, there, enabled. Uh, solar fold, solar hinges. Yeah, see, all those are enabled. But could have been just down to those hinges, uh, which is fine. Um, So you're going inside that way, right? Which means I need to go come sideways with that. Um, I'm gonna try and figure out if I did maybe one, two. Um, okay, need a bit more. Well, I could, yeah, I could do something like, maybe do it instead, like, so, let me see. Yeah, like, so, one there, one there. And then, I think, just to give it a bit of credence and, and like, the feeling like this could actually work, um, 
Drop that. Right. Yeah, 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 that, that's fine. So you're folding in on yourself there. <clears throat> and then basically another pair of hinges. Yeah. Well, the new hinges apparently do have the inertia tensors enabled. Um, yeah, it's enabled. Um, but yeah, like so, and then, as I was saying, a new pair of hinges. But before I place them, I, I would need to visualize it because, knowing me, I will place it wrong. <laughs> Um, but yeah, basically going to do the same over here. We're just we've got that block there, and I know I need to come sideways. Um, so one, two, one, two, and then I just need. Uh, did I do it this on? I think I placed those wrong. To be honest. I, I, I will we'll try it. Um, so we'll place them on the outside here as well. Yeah, one and two, right? And then bring the blocks up. Could probably. Can we? Can we get away with doubling this, I wonder? I have a certain look and feel that I have in mind. That's why I'm sort of experimenting here, right? Yeah, bring that up all the way, that's fine. Yep. Um, and I think it's time that we looked at our quotas quickly here. I had a feeling that, or we're just short on resources, so you never know. Um, so let's go and have a quick look at our refineries. They're doing their thing. Yeah, they're, they're doing their thing. Um, and just do that thing, please, because um, production. Okay, so you're, you're making the things you're needing and all that good stuff. It, it seems actually fine. What do we look like on components? Yeah, it's just all being made and it's all there. No, it, it looks fine. Um, but yeah, I think this is sort of a good start for that part. Let's see. Why is my light off again? Um, and so... This, this is another question. How is this going to behave? And more to the point, am I going to have enough space? Probably not. Um, I feel like I want to cheat time for this. I, I, I really don't like using creative tools, right? Please remember that. But I feel like because we want to observe behaviors here, we want to be able to see how it looks and what it does. So, I, f I feel scared. I, I feel genuinely scared to hit any of these, but I'm gonna hit them both together. I know my built and repair is still busy doing this, putting this together, but. No, this is actually awesome. I absolutely freaking love that. I mean, is that not just the... Oh, yes. Oh, no, no, no. Are you kidding me? Are you... What on earth... I 
cannot believe this. I like what the actual. Oh, oh no, just. Yeah, I know Tarsus. That was way too close. Shit. Like, holy crap! That was an ugly mess. Oh, just not okay. Um, I I feel so disheartened right now. I'm. I'm oh, I. Love well, I don't need to open the door now, I guess. Uh. Yeah, proof of concept works fine, actually. And I love how it comes together and moves, you know. Um, I, I need to move it away. And that much has been made fucking obvious. Excuse me, like, oh my goodness, I think. I'm just gonna go and try and fill out here what I can. I don't even know what place do you have the time to be honest. Okay, so. Well, that is some... Some damage I've done there, like, that's... Oh. Note yourself, don't do experiments right next to your base. I mean, good grief, I've, I've ripped holes everywhere. Uh, this is shocking. Even for me, this is shocking. I think there was another one, or did it? No, no. It's probably not going to grind this stuff off properly unless it's still attached. Oh. Oh, yes, yes, you're right, we, we may as well, you're right. And no, you didn't hate to ask, Tarsus. You loved every second of it. <laughs> um, copy, and then I'm just going to paste a duplicate of that. Um... Base counter. No, of course you're not. But guys, you know this is all in good fun and I really, really, really don't mind. It's, you know, it's a good learning experience for everyone else, I suppose. Because I never learned anything from this. Just trying to uh, give it some shape and semblance. Like, wait, what? Why is this a... I think this is actually completely detached, to be honest. I think I'm just gonna... Yeah. I think you're the same. Like, just... It. Like, holy crap. That that was... That was... I wouldn't even call it clang. That, that, that wasn't clang. That was... That was smoosh. Yeah, no, exactly, Tarsus, because I'm I'm having fun, right? Even when I do moments like that, and all I can do is just stare at it in helpless wonder. See it unfold in front of me. You know, I, I know the buttons I could have pushed to maybe prevent this, but I just... not. Nah. Oh, are you... Oh, hello. So, yeah, th this is a thing now. And there's a wasp up there as well. And it's an actual problem now that we haven't got this lined up or built up properly. I like 
Right, we're gonna have to do a thing here. I have a, I have, I have, I have a seat. I can take control of the big guy. Hoping that we've got ammo in that. And more to the point, why he hasn't, why he hasn't engaged yet. I don't know. There's only one round in the inventory. Are you kidding me? Go try anyways. Oh, he moved. Okay, I'm not getting them. Um, but apparently that was quickly resolved. Just having a quick nosy bit. I just want to cause a bit of trouble with it now. Ooh! That was a good hit. Nope. Are you not going to come down here? Have I not prodded you enough? Oh well. What's with this? What, what's with that green now turning red thing? I, I don't understand. Eh. Don't care. Um, the base will take care of it, I'm sure. Hopefully. Yeah, pure and utter destruction is about right. Tarsus, you, 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 you've got it in one. No. Not that block. Take that away. Thank you. Um... But, you know, as a proof of concept, it's worked, actually, and I'm, I'm already happy with that part. Um, and actually, there's no... Uh, bring those... Oh, yeah, and I, of course I don't have steel plate. You know, and, uh, that's, that's the next one. Uh, yeah, bring that out there. Bring that and that along, I think. Uh, oh yeah, bring those along here. Oh, hello. Sick him, boys. Sick him. Uh... And then that's going to be something, something, uh, Cora block. Boom, boom. Just going to try and close up the, the, the obvious holds just now. Um, that needs to turn like so, and then I can bring him around like so. Um, bring him along. Then I think I know what I'm doing here. Uh, yep, bring you along, and then I have another block I can place it in here. That sort of evens that out to such a corner. And then we can probably get away with putting one of them in there, one of them. And then just bring this round and make it look nice. Bam. Are you still busy with him or have you destroyed him? Like, I don't know. Something is still not quite... Ooh, wow. It, I have a feeling we didn't make Gardas. Uh, like... Like in our uh, quarter. Production quarter. Let's have a look. We have a... See? 
<laughs> no, nothing to see here. Just keep moving. Um, production assembler main. No, troll panel assembler main. Also, you are a co op one, but more. Oh, there's Curtis. I think we may need, may need more of them. Let's let's say fifty. Okay, and see how that goes. Um, but you know, damage has been basically, well, not undone, but it's 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 sorted, right? And then just two seconds, guys. Soon. But I think he's going down. Seriously, how is he still... <laughs> I have no idea how he's still flying, by the way. I'm not just going to leave him to his struggles up there. I, th I think Baze will deal with him if appropriate. We picked up a few components and a lot of scrap. Holy crap. No, give me, give me. Just I've got the small guys. Give me, give me the big guy. Where, where, where are you? Course it is. Because and I can I can just take a wild guess right now. Magnesium. Yeah oh no. Okay, I, I understand actually. Assembler main, I think there's an ammo we're missing. It's all kind of no, it's it! Set. Not pause production. Do the, do the thing. That's really got me puzzled now. I think I would like to up this um, to like sixty. All right. And then the other thing I was going to do, which do here, give me hydrogen tank. Stick that all in there and thanking you. Right, it's 
I really have to think about moving this guy, right? This, this is now my next challenge, right? We're going to have to move him if we want to do any more building on this because, well, we've, we've seen the mess we've created. Wait, I've had it. Where are you? Come here. What's that big guy? That's uh, a big thrust that I need to get rid of. <laughs> Maybe if we're quick, we can see it fall. <laughs> I even bounced. I'm not sure if it was the gun or if it was the fact of me ramming into him at full health. Um, it was one of those two. Maybe both. And boom. Yes, the counters went up. Don't worry. Um, and just, yeah, give me all of that. Thank you. Uh, that, that, was, that was hilarious, actually. Because he's actually now pissed me off. I'm sorry to say. Um, where are you? Uh, yeah, oh. Did he just... Bye bye. Oh. Hmm. You are surprising me. Whoa, 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 line of fire, line of fire, line of fire. Geek. Oh, that was a little bit. I, I, I don't know how he's still flying. I have no idea. Ooh, I'll do. The rest is just mopping up the rest of the grid. Hey, I've survived. Are you gonna keep wasting ammo on that now? Or was that it? Might as well. That is all just scrap and metal pieces. Okay, nothing interesting there. Oh, yeah. Nice. Um, so now the, the question for me really is how am I going to move this behemoth? Um, well, it's sort of obvious, obviously, uh, you know, in, in a way that you're going to have to give it some sort of, sort of thrust. But, although I am toying with the idea of just attaching wheels for now, for some reason. Um, um, I don't know, like, I think it would be the easier solution right now to just plonk wheels on it and just get it moving forwards. Um, rather than worry about thrusters. And then I don't have to worry about thrust weight and, you know, 
thrust to weight ratio and all that. Uh, I feel like that may be a thing that I'm going to do temporarily, just to get him moving forwards, just away from base a bit. Um, I, I don't know what else to consider there. Like, I feel like I'm not quite ready for thrusters on this big guy yet. And I feel like even those wheels are going to be expensive already. Um, like this. I have five by fives. That's just a wheel. I need the... So it has the 5 by 5s in that block, so that's... What do I just need these then? Like... And then, uh, that's the wrong side actually, so... But yeah, I, I suppose... <coughs> that would be it. No, that's a 3 by 3 I want the big guy. Oh, he has a big footprint. So, I suppose. Okay, steel plate, of course. But yeah, let's let's grab some steel plate. I think I'm gonna just put it on wheeled for now, just to move it forward. Just it's not like we need to move miles away from the base. It's just get a bit of moving space. Control panel, uh, inventory. All of them, please show me steel plate. And then basically, yeah, I can we can work on that sort of it. What is the okay? We've got another half hour before I have to call it for today. Um, I'm, I was hoping for three hours, but my wife's returned early and she's not feeling too great, so I'm not gonna. No annoy her, well not annoy her, but um, be more obnoxious by staying on stream for ages. So, um, I think we're going to just place that right like so. Right. It. Right now I'm just interested in getting this thing moving. Just fives. Six. Like that's it. One up there and one there. Okay. I know I've just Thought we'd put this together, but we're gonna have to pick up part again. Going to have to come a little bit forward, I think. No, I'm on the wrong side, that's why that didn't work. I need to come forward a bit, I think. Yeah, and I know it's not even e uh, even, um, but the problem would have been that we would have landed right in the base and then destroyed more of it. Um, but okay, this should allow me to no. Remember, we need to do another thing where we need to convert the whole grid into a dynamic grid as well. Um, because at the moment it's considered a static grid, which is why the windmills are working. Um, just try to see what I can have up with and build. So, but that's basically that part. Um, I'm assuming those batteries have a bit of charge in them. Like, yeah. Uh, let me just actually check. Uh, 
mobile based batteries we have got what's that two four six eight big batteries oh it's right there as well so there's eight big ones on there right now that i'll do for now just to get us moving get moving forwards and then i can build the rest of this stuff um i'm assuming it's now a question of materials like I'm sure if we checked here and if Sebastian wasn't so stupid sometimes where is it now um steel plate 5000 small tubes some large tubes been has still there but yeah there it is there's our meme yet again go on Tarsus call it I'll, I'll leave you the honor oh yes thank you Um, and then we're just gonna do make sure no wait, that 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 everything's on. We're now unlocked and then take off, and yeah, you know the usual. Yeah, iron, correct. And right there, I've done the coasting thing again, where you you just take your forwards facing thrusters. Um, and so again, to clarify, when I say forwards facing, I mean that the thrust points forward, but the thrust vector itself actually would be pushing you backwards, right? But anyways, um, just do the coasting thing I get here and then just make a bit more space. And I'm hoping I'm gonna be able to do sort of like a Yeah, drop down like this basically and mine that way. Because it feels like I can at least have a bit more control and then we can now come down. So I'll start here. Yeah. I'm just fine. Yep, that's it. Yeah, the usual. I'm imagining, yes, of course. The stone thing is really quite annoying. Um, but we can do we we can we can help ourselves a little bit. Right. And then obviously the ejectors are doing the, the rest of it. Which is quite nice. Feels like we've got quite a bit of iron on us here. Right? I think if we just look for iron particularly. Yeah, it looks actually quite good. And there's still cobalt on here. So it's not actually been emptied out. Hmm. Did I do? I did. I, I did it. I'm, uh, I did a thing. I'm stuck. And I can't get my camera. Nope. Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go again.
Uh-huh. Well, guess what? I've done a... I've done a thing here. Um, there is a sort, and I'm, it may actually not be it set up correctly. But right now, we, we have bigger issues. Like, massively bigger issues. So, um, can we... Give me all of this stone. Drop it. Trying to get rid of weight in the miner. Yeah, see, my problem with Tarsus is it won't even let me. Oh. Okay, we're sort of in a better position now. What? What's my alignment here? I need to. We're not getting enough thrust here. I don't know why. Now I'm on the... Come on. Miner is so useless. My good. Oh. Just gonna try and aim towards my base and just. Uh, uh, I don't even know. Absolutely useless. It's shocking, actually. Um, and actually, yeah, so there is a sorter on the base. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Just... This is absolutely turning into a shambles already. Yet again. So there is a sort of there, I was saying, um... And it should have pulled the materials out realistically. Um, I'm just gonna go and check on it. It's literally here. It, underneath. It, um, is it? Did we? I don't actually think I did catharsis. You may actually be right. These are all just conveyor tubes. This. So is this. And this is just a normal piston, and that's special there. And there's a. Okay, so we can we can do one or two things here. Um, then we're just gonna do this thing. Yeah, 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 oh, for goodness sakes. Just... Oh, just... oh, for goodness sakes. There's a thing. Pick it. Pick up. Inventory full. Yeah, of course. Okay, I don't even care. Um, Can we can we de deposit in here? Ten components could not be deposited. So you're basically telling me that the connection isn't working. Is that what you're telling me? Like if I was to go up here and I say, give me the hydrogen tank, for example. 
No, it's working. You can definitely pass things through. Oh, you're kidding. Thank you, Tarsus. Um, yeah, that's 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 a bit of an issue because we, I didn't plan for that. Uh, we can probably get away with doing a thing here. Um, just like out there, maybe, but. No, why not? Okay, I, I am getting more and more confused by a minute here. Anyways, for now, I'm gonna try and get that thing landed before it runs out of battery. Oh, I can't. Mm -hmm. okay, no, well, we can do the other thing. I can, I can do this thing. We can just land it and just... And I'll turn it off, at least. And stop there. Right, thank you. Uh, off, off, off. Right, and so you're telling me. Yeah, well, let, let's try and what is it? Sort I need. Mm. No, I don't think they're in there. Doesn't look like it. I could probably get away with one of these. Uh, I do like them. And that one seems to be facing the right way. Or not? No, it was. I was just not looking at it right way. But I can't because interior plate. Now, if I asked you for the components for this, not for that, for this. No, they're computers, and I don't want computers. Give me just some interior plate to get this started for Christ's sakes. Out of language there. <laughs> now I need to make sure, are we... Yeah, like so. Boom. Right, and then a connector right on top of that, please. So, oh, this is gonna just get better and better. Construction components, which, let me guess, we don't have any. No, I don't actually know how they look anymore. No, we don't. Yes, of course we don't. And construction components are iron. Okay, so iron is pretty much incoming. I'm a little bit anyways. So we can do the thing and just be lazy here. Right, give me, give me access here, please. Why not? Because it's in the connector. I'll take it. Just give me all of it, please. Six. Or as much as I can. Um, what did I need that for? Oh yeah, iron goes in, in here because it needs refined. Honestly, my brain is starting to get really frazzled here. Iron, go build, please, in there and then... I think the refineries just pull this out themselves, right? Or maybe not. Maybe actually not. Um, don't don't work on that, please. Just 
Now this should be fairly quick. You go do this. Um, the next you can work on a bit of stone there. And as a matter of fact, just go down there and then do it like so. Right. Which means now... This should start to get built up soonish. Um, and here, this is also fairly important to get together. So I would like to get this moved before the end of episode. And yeah, so I really have a big problem here in that my storage is entirely full at base. Um, from what I can see. Well, not entirely, but it's where we're really getting to the no, large one still got plenty of space actually so it's fine that way so let's just go and deposit all that stuff um, I'm wondering which yeah, let's work on this first so give me the components that we need for that And that one's built up. Coolio. Let's go. <clears throat> Just put them into production on top of what we already have. This really bugs my happiness. This is so much bugging my happiness. Um... So you're the one that actually connects right through, so if I disconnect it, it'd be sort of bad news, but not really for long. Maybe in between episodes. Um, I have a... F Wait, did we even... This could be a thing, where we didn't even put a quarter on them. Catwalk, catwalk, catwalk. Let, let's try that. Because I have been experimenting a little bit with this Tarsus, um, and so when I put down a graded catwalk, right, it, it's this really weird thing that won't let me place it there. Alright, I'll need components as well, that would probably help. Um, Right. It won't let me place there, but if I do this or not. Ah, oh, for goodness sakes. Okay, construction components is just a meme at the moment. I'll we'll just have to wait and see. And that is just unfortunately what it is. Um, So much to do, and literally, I'm. Um, right, let's have a look at the production here. Yeah, it's, it's still iron. Let's see then, how much iron can I pull out of here? Be a bit. At least we're not hunt mining. Could be a lot worse. We could be still down in the holes ourselves. And then just make sure that the refinery does that first, please. I've actually done a mistake to be honest. Um, if while looking here I have put into production somewhere a whole bunch of construction components that 
I don't even know anymore. I feel like there's a bottleneck here somewhere that shouldn't be. So if I took you and there's another, I have an actual refinery, I'm sure. Or maybe I'm just talking up my arse. No, there it is. There, see? Go and do. That's better, I think. Right. And then just let them do their thing. I, I really just... Uh, not... Not happy with progress right now. I'd almost be tempted to say, uh, built and pair, go and just not do the thing. Uh, Production. Okay, production is coming back a little bit better now. Let me go and try and merge these productions together a little bit. Because this, this is still something I don't understand why it's done like this, but it does it like that. So we just have to live with it. And construction components. That's that's what I'm really after. And iron again, of course. Um, oh, come on. Yes, give me all that. That too. Well, can stay in there for now. And then let's see here. Boom, get that. Finery. No, not the basic. I want it in there. So much quicker. Right, and I have a feeling it's still not enough. Right. We'll never know. We'll, we'll see. Um, yeah, yeah, I know. Just... Hello, wasp. I see you there. And what do you think you're up to? Do you, do you want to come over here? Do you want to cause trouble? Or... Just gonna leave him be and, and hope for the best. Um, I'll start spot it moving to intercept. Nope, I don't think they're leaving us alone. I don't think they're leaving us alone. Um, I don't know, like. They don't look like they're actually engaging us here. Oh, great fun. I have nothing in my ammo boxes. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, I'm also on the wrong tower, that's why. Yeah, that, that, would, that would do it. From toolbar. I don't No, that's not what I wanted. From Uber, I'm just gonna I don't know. Take a wild guess. Yes, this is better. Because this guy at least has ammo.
I'm just trying to see if I can get a reaction or if we do like I don't know what he's up to, like I, I feel Feel he's getting a bit too close for comfort, to be honest. Uh, I don't like him there. Uh, it's not phased yet. doing if he's just because he definitely seems to be inching closer and closer for sure trust you, I don't like you, I don't... Sort of hovering always between the 1 and 1.2k mark. Yeah, I'm starting to wonder that myself, if he's going to be like the last guy that we've sort of dealt with. Come on, just come a bit closer. We're not going to hurt you much. You know what? This this is actually starting to annoy me. Well, not annoy me, but I feel like I want to sort of clear the air. So, oh you, I'm just gonna do a sneaky thing here. And then hopefully he should be coming after me in a second and try not to just splat myself into the ground too hard. No, he's not even interested. Sure, we can watch it falling. Yeah, it was that close. In fact, Tarsus, that it wasn't close. It was deadly. <laughs> uh. Oh yes, uh, clone counter. Bef before I forget, I'll be clone number fifteen. And then we can just hopefully grab all this. And I'm gonna try again because I am that stupid. And maybe I'm not gonna aim directly at it this time. That would probably help. Yeah, it's just so uh, helpless in the air. How, how do you do that? Is that just Z and Z? I don't know. How do you set onto auto dampening? What the? F I think he fell to the ground and I followed him or something. Not so much um, what button is more like I've seen it happen automatically, but I don't understand how I would do it. 
that's I think my bigger question if that makes sense. And no, no, I, I can't believe this. Like he's killed me twice now. Well, I killed myself on him twice, and I know I, I will not. Wee! That was a little bit closer than I would have liked. Oh, my base is shooting at me now. Ooh! That's a nice wee crater. One block for us. And, well, a few steel blocks. The rest has been sacrificed to Clang, I think. <laughs> Ooh! Ammo box, I'll take. And then the rest is just gonna be... Round up quickly. Oh, up. Nothing exciting here, really. It's just bits of steel. Ah, controls it. Cheers for that, uh, Tarsus. I will try that next time. And like we could try it even on on here. Like this should be. Aye. And then we control Z again. Oh, Tarsus, you've just solved one of the biggest mysteries in space engineers for me. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's that's how you do the auto dampening. That's actually good to know. So next time you're like when I'm near a grid, that uh, probably will generate a little bit of gravity, as it were, because that's how you have to think about it. Um, you can set your dampness to it. Now, can we? Please get this stuff together, please. Huh. Of course, construction components. And also, I forgot to reset my time offset. Apologies for that. Um, so, I would normally like this offset always to be set as zero only time I change it is when we need to do, you know, looky look lose at, at stuff, but I wasn't entirely happy with that. Anyways, I think actually we are in a fairly good position. I'm, I'm, I'm actually fairly happy with what we've got today. Um, proof of concept for the solar folding on the big rover. There's a whole bunch of materials we've got on our side and just probably but now we'll get rid of um, then but yeah so I'm, I'm quite happy and you know we've got a bit more we've learned a little bit about the sensor grids and having scripts that interfere with your hangar doors you know learn something there we have done an extension on this guy Yeah, for a great view of destruction. <laughs> um, but yeah, so, you know, this, I quite like where this is going. As I said, we've got a proper assembler here now, so we're not being held back in our base production in general. And we just need more materials, I think. That's just literally what it comes down to. Um, to get all this filled out get the decoy actually built for a change because it's been sort of not been built for ages now um, yeah a few clangs a few explosions uh, I, I had fun I really enjoyed myself um, yeah would like to thank everyone for attending it's always great to you know have people attending and, and give me hints and tips in the, in the stream I absolutely love it and yeah i would say until tomorrow actually thanks for watching yet again please leave a like and subscribe it helps the algorithm show me who likes the videos and sh helps youtube show you the right videos as well and yeah if you've got any questions leave a comment down in the doobly doo or you can just go on our discord i've pinned it in the, in the chat and join us there we're always sort of 
discussing all things space engineer and you know other things as well but yeah that's basically all there's to it for today thanks again and peace out